When you think of all that engineers have created, the Golden Gate Bridge, the Hoover Dam, the space station, and doing it without Billy Siegenfeld's class. Did you see what I'm doing? Okay. Swing out! Who knows what aspiring engineers at Northwestern University will craft outside after picking up swing. I think that there were moments probably when uh, the dean was kind of wondering, uh, is this really what, what we should be doing? Uh, but I think he's really, I think, uh, embraced it. <laughs> Right-brained students using some of their left brains and feet. I'm taking calculus and physics and classes like that, but this really lets me break out of my engineering shell and interact with people in in a completely different way. The class is called whole body thinking. Dancing, yes. Two, three, four, five, six. To do swing dancing means letting go. It means letting go of your weight, feeling that you can bounce and groove around. And uh, I would say that the engineers, of course, have a problem doing that sometimes. Where's that swing bounce? But the lessons here also apply to life. It's really interesting to see how much better the communication happens each week and how much better we connect and share the weight and share the rhythm and like develop the dance that way. She goes, huh? Huh? Things don't always go according to plan. So if you're in the leadership position, what do you do? So you really have to be able to think on your feet. And one. The minds of engineers. Huh. That's right. Tackling a new way of thinking. Keep cool, baby. One step yeah. at a time. You make Lee Powell, the Associated Press. Good.